my name is Mariah and welcome to my channel Totally Spines and today's video I am going to be doing a mini book haul. This is the first haul that I'm doing since the book buying ban has been lifted and this also will be my last one until maybe the fall. I plan to move in the late summer so I'm trying not to get too, <laughs> too many books. As you can see there's a lot of books on these shelves and majority of them I have not read so I think it's it's high time that I stop purchasing books and actually reading them so yeah let's get into the video so the first book that I got was The Naturals by Jennifer Lynn Barnes this is the same author that wrote The Inheritance Games uh, I forgot what this book is about but it's book one of four in a series and it's like a YA suspense thriller type of situation. So I'm excited to read this. The next book is Heartstopper by Alice Oseman. I heard a lot of positive things about this series. This is volume one. Um, I have the other volumes in my cart. Uh, I know there's a Netflix series on this and everybody loves the show as well so i'm excited to read this this will definitely be pretty interesting to go into next books that i got are mangas i have a spy family volume seven there's damien on the cover he is so cute like see like if you see him in his outfit this outfit is so nice and i also have volume eight I pre-ordered volume 9 and that should come out next Tuesday so a week from this video yeah so yeah I'll put it on the screen that is volume 9 that I will have I wanted to make it part of this video next book that I have is called the do-over by Lynn Painter I follow Haley Pham and she is a Lynn Painter stan. She loves the do-over and also Better Than the Movies. That is by Lynn Painter. Um, Lynn Painter knows about Haley Pham because she put her in the acknowledgments on the back of this book. So that's pretty nice as well. I love a good time loop story, okay? Groundhog Day is a classic. Everybody knows it. They even refer to time loops as Groundhog Day. So... I absolutely am excited to read this. Uh, fun fact, Bill Mary's character in Groundhog Day experienced the same day for over 10 years. That is a long time to not learn your lesson. But anyway, I love time loop stories and movies. I love Groundhog Day, Spring, Palm Springs, Naked. Um, there's some other time loop movies that I've seen and they're kind of sad, so yeah there's that but nonetheless there is this one the main character Emily is experiencing the worst day of her life over and over again which happens to fall on Valentine's Day so I am excited to <laughs> read this what I find interesting is that <laughs> in every scenario she has different outfits on and of course Nick here her possible love interest is obviously wearing the same thing because he's not aware of the time loop but yeah and to stay on brand with time loops i decided to get another book and it's called see you yesterday now i ordered this and this hasn't arrived yet i'm not sure when it will be delivered but it's by rachel lynn solomon and that is the same author that wrote today tonight tomorrow which is on my roy g biff shelf in the blues and i haven't I haven't read it yet so but see you yesterday is a time loop and from my understanding the main characters are stuck in an elevator so that sounds good to me <laughs> so I got that so that would be very exciting to read and that will just call it for you know my mini book haul <laughs> yeah so if you read any of these books do let me know in the comment section below if you enjoyed them what you like what you didn't like no spoilers though like just say if you liked it or not that would be great 
and if you have any recommendations from these authors that I've mentioned. So thank you so much for stopping by and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Thank you.